I ever lost, I miss my mind the most, but it's coming back in dribbles and drabs. I survived all that, and I know too many people who didn't. And it was all based around that you can do it, and that the light at the end of the tunnel may be you. And it's not an oncoming train. When and the power of positive thinking, and life's a journey, not a destination, and all that stuff really is candy for the brain. The glass is half full and not half empty. All that's the spiritual side that I needed to, to fertilize. I needed to cultivate, so, you know, because that's how songs are grown. Did you have a parallel experience to that? Because, I mean, I think of the time that you were sleeping on your manager's couch and you were doing the solo projects and you'd done the third... How does she know all this shit? <laughs> <laughs> What's going on here? She knows about it. Yeah. I know you're there. Yeah. <laughs> and you were in a hotel in New York at the same time. Jeez. And, uh, yeah, yeah, that's it. But did you have a parallel experience? I mean, was it a spiritual kind of place that you got to? Or did you just get fed up with feeling awful? I got sick and tired of feeling sick and tired. I think that it was like a, a gradual thing rather than like a lightning bolt coming down and going, this is the way, you know, it's like a little bit of uh, just being fortunate to live through it and be awake and not take that one last shot and have it be the end. You know, we were just fortunate and I was fortunate that I was able to like uh, have somebody to shake me and go, you know, try it this way. I'm not sure if I would be sober if he wasn't. Or the rest of the band we were really tight in that. Um, and that it's a miracle. I mean, it's a miracle that we're here. The type of lifestyle that we went for was just totally... Are you going to mainline some of this stuff? We're going to mainline it, Wow. There you go. Thanks, Ray. Sure.